Today is a somber anniversary in Massachusetts. It marks 40 years since state police trooper George Hanna was shot and killed during a traffic stop in Auburn. Now an award in his name is the highest medal a Massachusetts law enforcement officer can receive. Boston 25 News reporter Jim Morelli spoke with Hanna's daughters about the legacy he leaves behind. It actually feels like yesterday. But in reality, close to 15,000 yesterdays have passed since the day life changed for the Hanna family. He wasn't supposed to work that day. But Officer George Hanna of the Massachusetts State Police picked up an extra shift on February 26, 1983. It would be his last. And I remember for some odd reason that I walked him to his cruiser and I watched him drive up Richard Road Hill. Deborah Hanna was 14 years old at the time, her sister Kim, 13. Never thinking that the, that would be the last day that I would see my father alive. George Hanna was shot and killed that night while making a routine traffic stop in Auburn. Three men were later convicted of his murder. They are each serving life sentences. These officers that have families, they leave and they don't know truly if they'll be back. Each year, the Hanna family recognizes some officers who didn't come back, as well as some who did, with the George L. Hanna Memorial Award for Bravery. It's a quality that police officers increasingly have to carry. It's not just a routine call now, could be much more than that. 40 years ago, it was much more than that. And I know in my heart that we'll see him again. But here on earth, there have been graduations, marriages, the birth of George Hanna's grandchildren without him. We still have that endless pit in our heart. We will miss him every minute of our lives. In Douglas, Jim Morelli for your local station, Boston 25 News.